Hi. Today we will see how to transfer a style from one image to other images with the help of the IP adapter. We will also use masks, and so that we can get consistent results and a uniform style in a series of images, we will also show how to automate the entire process, so that in the end you can insert a single word, and get the desired result. Let's start at the beginning, and build the workflow together. You can of course find the workflow and all the necessary links in the description of the video. We will work with the Juggernaut XL Lightning model, there is also a clip set last layer node to minus one. Positive prompt, National Geographic photo of a lion, city lights in background, high quality, photorealistic, sharp. Negative prompt, empty latent, width 1216, height 832. And of course K sampler, whose various values I chose according to what is recommended in the model card in Civit AI. And so that we can check things properly, we also select fix seed, and press Q. This is the picture we got, a very good picture in my opinion, considering the small number of steps. Now I want to have a more dramatic atmosphere, and maybe also a little melancholic, as exists in this picture. In order to get this style, we will use an IP adapter, we are using the new version as of today v2, we will bring the IP adapter tiled node to which we will connect the IP adapter model, because we are working with the SDXL model we have chosen the plus SDXL model, note that although this a model that is compatible with SDXL, in clip vision we have to choose a 1.5 model, it's very confusing, but that's how it works. We of course need our reference image, and in order to have a good comparison, I will simply copy the previous case sampler, with the same seed and exactly the same values, so that we can see the effect of the IP adapter on the final image, and click on Q. As you can see, the IP adapter really changed the original image, and it is very far from the desired result, we will try to play a bit with the weights, and see what comes out, there is no doubt that now we get a lion, but it is very different from what we got without the IP adapter, and I want a composition more like the original. Let's try to change the weight type to style transfer, it's already much closer, but you can see the effect of the reference image on the lion, and I want it mainly on the background, so we'll try to raise the start at a bit, this allows the model to start working without the effect of the IP adapter, and it comes into action at a later stage. Depends on how much we raised it. And you see that now the result is really similar to the original in terms of composition, but you can clearly see the effect the reference has on the lion, which comes out a little less contrasty, and the color of the fur is also affected by the reference. To prevent this we will have to use a mask, I remind you that we want to automate this process, therefore we need a tool that can create a mask without drawing it manually, I will use batch clip seg, this tool allows us to create a mask based on a keyword, our word in this case will be lion. We can connect the first workflow to the clip segment, select the mask preview node and see the mask it produces for us, it looks good enough in the attention mask, because we only want to affect on the background and not on the animal, we will apply the mask with the invert mask node, and connect the inverted mask to the IP adapter. And this is what we got now, you can see that we have returned the color and contrast to the lion, and we still get the haze and atmosphere from the reference image in the background. Let's see if it works for us with another animal, I changed the lion to an owl both in the prompt and in the clip segment, and it seems to work really well. In order to make this workflow automatic, so we can only choose the type of animal and everything will work, we just need to find a way to replace the type of animal both in the clip segment and at the prompt. We will start with the prompt, we will search for replace, and this is the node we need, text find and replace, we will connect this to text input, we will copy the prompt we wrote to here, and instead of a specific animal, we'll just write animal. This will be our code word. We will change the replace to input, and copy the text input node, here we will write the type of animal we want to get, we will connect everything to some show text node, it doesn't matter which one, and we'll see if everything works. Excellent, now we will connect the type of the animal to the clip segment, here too we will change the text to input, 
and we will also change our prompt to input. Let's check that everything is connected and working, let's change the type of the animal to leopard and press Q. And that's the beauty of Comfy, you can automate almost any idea, work technique, and build mini software that will produce the desired results. So I hope you learned and we will meet in the next lessons. You are of course welcome to ask questions, subscribe to the channel, and like, if you liked it. And most importantly, have fun. Bye.